So where are we going? Amarillo first. And then what? And then hopefully Black Cow Grasslands as long as the storms aren't too bad tonight. And then we ride east. Ride east. Okay. Ride east and then you'll find out then where we're going. Moto camping at the Black Kettle National Grasslands. It's in western Oklahoma, not far from the Texas border. Those are the trash cans. This is our campsite. We do have some neighbors. This is Doll and I stayed here, same place last year. We have a lot of different kinds of birds. This is the tent my dad is staying in. He joined us for this adventure. This is our tent. <laughs> There's our tent. Yes, we use an inflatable mattress. <laughs> There's our campground. There's Donald. Our trusty little tent. Tent. Ch uh, there you are. Our pavilion. Pavilion. Good lord, I can't talk today. Pavilion? A Picnic table. table. You can see I've been tired. So. How many miles There's did you do? I think we did 400 miles today. Uh, we are over 500 miles. Oh, 500 miles. No wonder we're so tired and I can't think straight. Our fire pit, even though we're not allowed to burn tonight, so we won't. And there's the lake, or one of the many, one of the few lakes that are part of the Black Kettle National Grasslands. It's free to camp here, and there is fresh water here, and there is restrooms. It's more like a porta potty style, but okay. This is a must for anyone camp, doing moto camping or any type of camping that requires you to have lightweight stuff, a jet boil. And we found these. These are uh, Gerber. By, uh, Gerber. Gerber. Not uh, the baby food. Yeah, not the baby food. <laughs> uh, but uh, uh, it has a spatula, a spork, and a spoon. 
uh, vegetable pillar, uh, bottle opener, and can opener. Uh, and it packs down like that. All in one. All in one, yeah. There's a little bit more view of the of course, campgrounds. Camping uh, stove. Other, oh, yeah. The camping stove requires yeah. fuel. Don't forget so. the fuel. Don't forget the fuel. There's the rooms over there. Always make sure you bring extra toilet paper just in case it's not stocked. And there are well, two large. No. no. <laughs> There's two two very large pavilions over there that just have water source. Those are good for parties when you're allowed to do that again. But again, there's one of the lakes. It's really pretty over there. And like I said, Don and I stayed here last year. It was pretty comfortable. Heard a really large owl above us. Been hearing that oh, the tonight, the, earlier, not long ago, heard the uh, coyotes. There are coyotes out here. So we already heard them already carrying on. Really pretty out here. <laughs> 